Welcome to Vincent Dumon's review of Engaging Seigi no Dragon. First, I will introduce the group Engaging. E N G A G dot I N G. Their catchphrase is Kimi dake no heroin shibo. Kimi wa dare to engage shimasu ka? Translated into English, this is we want to be only your heroine. Who will you get engaged to? So it's kind of a heavy question to be asked by an idol group, but it's okay. It's okay. They are affiliated with Deer Stage, sort of a maid cafe, performance stage, production company for idols and maids. Most famous for being the home of Denpagumi Inc. It is focused mainly on internet and geek or otaku culture, and I guess it's well known that、um, many of the idols or people affiliated with their stage are actually otaku or geeks in real life. And it's like if you look at their profiles, each one has like specialties that they are.、Uh, More interested in. I don't I don't know the details unfortunately for most of them, but they do have their own kind of like specialties like, oh, I'm really into、uh, race cars and I'm really into、um, doing laundry. No, these aren't real.、Uh, anime, video games, things like that.、Um, pizza? No, that would be me. No.、Uh, to be honest, I'm not really up to date on it. I don't know the details of Deer Stage or how it works or anything. I've never been there, but it is a thing. So, this group started in January of 2018. They have five members. The members are Amane, Amano Maria, Kobato Ria, Pomura Yuka, and Aikawa Kozue. The sound of the group is similar to early Denpagumi Inc., in my opinion. And in my opinion, that's a good thing. I'm a big fan of Denpagumi Inc., specifically the earlier stuff. Not that their new stuff is bad, but I just kind of prefer their older stuff. And engaging definitely has that kind of sound and that kind of energy to it. So it's great. I originally came into contact with this group at Tokyo Idol Festival 2019. I just happened to be、um, at a stage there to see whatever group was next. Went up to the front to be ready for the group that I went to see. And、uh, engaging, came on and performed. A lot of times you meet some pretty cool new artists at Tokyo Idol Festival when you're just at the stage hanging out, and sometimes you're just kind of bored and waiting for them to finish so you can get to the one that you wanted to see.、Uh, in this case, it was a great surprise, and I became a fan instantly just from that one performance. As a matter of fact, I think that performance is on YouTube, so if I can、uh, find it and if I remember, I will put a link to that performance in the Description thing down there or whatever. High energy performance, the skill level was really high, and they did a really good job. and I enjoyed the music. I went and I met Amane at the picture taking event. She was really funny. We did a hamburger eating pose because she found out I was from America. So, anyway, let's talk about this new single here. First song is Seigi no Dragon Engaging. It's super high energy. It's got like kind of video game, like 16 bit sounds, which are really cool. I like that. It's very distinctive. This track in particular has kind of a Chinese sound to it. There's like Chinese instruments, kind of Chinese themes in the music. And even in the lyrics, they have like Chinese phrases and words in there. For example, there's a part where instead of saying Ichi ni san shi, they say E R san su. Even the cover art and the back art and like the booklet. The CD itself all has kind of like a Chinese theme. I guess they shot the artwork at a、uh, Chinese restaurant or something. So, and the costumes, of course, are in that theme as well. A lot of the lyrics in the song sound like they're talking about like Chinese food and eating food. As it goes on, there's a, there's a lyric that says, Yasashi kobushi de donna o nayami datte kaiketsu sa, which means any Type of problem you're having can be solved with kind fist. The, the overall theme of the song is about、um, I know kung fu, meaning kung fu of love, kind of fun. Overall, it's all about kind of getting stronger and building yourself up with the、uh, ultimate strength being. 
kindness. I really like this song. It's really awesome. High energy. The production is really good. I really like the chorus. It has like two parts. The first part is kind of like a breakdown and then it goes into the second part of the main part of the chorus and it's really fun and I, it's a really it's a really memorable song and I like it. I imagine that it will be a, uh, a big hit at the live shows when they start performing this in concerts. Track number two is My Sweet Weapon Choco. Choco being chocolate in Japanese or abbreviation of chocolate I guess. So we've gone from we've gone from kung fu of love to weapons of chocolate. It's kind of a theme on the single so far I guess. The song is all about making chocolate like homemade chocolate as a weapon to attack that special someone with. Uh, there's a part in the song where there's kind of like a call and response, which is very reminiscent of Denpagumi Inc. So you can really hear the relation there. Overall, this is another high energy track, but it's going for like the cute um, thing where the girls like it and then the boys like it. And that's that. Track three, Beat Egg. So we have Kung Fu of love, weapons of chocolate, and now we're beating eggs. This is a violent CD single, man. Right when the track starts, it sounds like you've just walked through the doorway into a Japanese video game arcade, or Geisen. It's a very exciting sound. It's really uh, powerful and loud, but done really well, and I like it a lot. This is actually an Easter song, if you couldn't tell by the egg part. It is a song about Easter, which is timely because right now it's the, it's the end of February. We're coming into the spring season here in 2020, so I guess everyone will be cranking this song at their Easter celebration parties. Uh, I don't even know if they have Easter in Japan, so it's kind of interesting that they have this here. It is interesting to have a J-pop idol song about Easter. I don't think I've ever heard one before. This is probably the first one I've ever heard. So they've got that going. This is another very fast paced, high energy track. In particular this one, the instrumental is uh, pretty crazy. Bam, 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 and it's just going. Sounds are all over the place. Doesn't let up and uh, I love it. I like it, I like it a lot. This track sounds a bit like Denpagumi Inc, but not exactly. So it sounds sort of like a relative of Denpagumi Inc which makes sense because they are the sister group of Denpagumi Inc. Uh, and it really sounds like it on this track here in particular. One thought I had while listening to this song was that it would be great to put on your earphones while you're out exercising or pumping iron or whatever you do to get in shape. It's like audio caffeine. If you listen to the track, you'll know what I mean. Easter gonna get today. Okay, so overall, this is another great release by Engaging. I love their full length album. I haven't been disappointed with anything they've put out so far, and this new single is awesome as well. They don't disappoint. They know their strengths, and they're playing straight to them. They're not doing weird experimentation or doing anything unexpected. There's a bit of a, I mean, who knew they'd be doing a song about Easter and, and that kind of thing, but uh, they've got a great formula, and they're sticking to it here, and it sounds fresh, so I give them credit for doing what they do best and doing it. I have to mention here that the cover art is awesome. I love it. Sort of looks like the uh, Coin of Fortune cookie artwork in a way. I don't know if it was maybe done by the same artist, but it's similar, sort of like the old uh, 80s, 70s action movie poster. It's really cool. And I saw somewhere on Twitter that they have like posters up in Japan promoting the single with this artwork, and I really want one of those posters. Of course, they don't have them here in America, and I. Uh, have no have no way of getting one, but I really want one of those posters because that artwork is awesome. And for me, when a group pays special attention to everything, including like the artwork for a single, and it's all awesome, I have to give like double credit for that. It just leaves a really good impression. My favorite tracks in order are the track number one, Seiki no Dragon, which by the way means uh, Dragon of Justice. I forgot to mention that earlier, but Seigi is Justice, and of course Dragon is Dragon, so that's Dragon of Justice. So. My favorite tracks on this release are in order. Uh, number one, Seigi no Dragon. Number two is the third track, Beat Egg. My third favorite is the second track on the single, My Sweet Weapon Choco. I don't know, I'm just not really big on the whole cutesy kind of thing as much as I am into the high energy video game sounding tracks. That's more my kind of thing, I guess. But that's my opinion and that's why I'm here doing the review. As of right now, 
there are no music videos for any of these tracks so I can't link to anything on YouTube yet but they may be making something later I don't know uh, otherwise they do have other stuff that you can check out on YouTube they've got music videos they have actually like a lot of live performances which I recommend checking out because their live performances are awesome speaking of which if you get a chance you gotta go check out engaging live whatever you pick up from the releases you hear will be like magnified and amplified you'll be a much bigger fan when you hear and see these songs perform live speaking of which this group is getting bigger and bigger and they're kind of blowing up they're going to be continuing to get bigger and continuing to get more and more fans so this is a good opportunity to jump in here sort of at the ground floor become a fan before it's before there's a billion fans uh, and you can you can say you were there from the beginning and it's exciting to watch them grow and get bigger and bigger and put out bigger releases each time uh, apparently they're doing like crowdfunding for uh, the next for music videos or something so if you want to participate in that that's cool all right so as you can tell I like this release quite a bit however I really loved two out of the three tracks with the third track uh, in my ranking being not as much of a home run as the other two but still good so with that in mind my overall ranking uh, of Seigi no Dragon by Engaging is four dragons with eggs and chocolate out of five dragons with egg and chocolate.